In this short video I will show you how to use Autodesk raster design tools and commands to position an image in a special context, save georeference information for further use and how to convert raster data to vector data including optical character recognition. Raster design is the Autodesk solution for managing, converting, analyzing and editing all types of raster images in AutoCAD software and applications based on AutoCAD. With powerful raster editing and raster to vector conversion tools, Autodesk AutoCAD raster design software helps you easily edit, enhance and maintain scanned drawings and make the most of raster images, maps, aerial photos, satellite imagery and digital elevation models. In this first example I have an underlying vector map which I will use as a reference. I could use survey data, import survey features to the drawing and relate those features with points in the image. Using match command I only need to specify two points and the image will be positioned and rotated as required. In order to avoid repeating these steps in the future I can embed image in that drawing or I can save the location file so next time the image will appear in correct location and with correct rotation. In the second example I'm going to use raster to vector conversion tools to quickly and more accurately convert raster drawing data into editable vector drawing. I start by inserting already geolocated scanned image presenting a map of an area. Wide range of editing tools can help to clean up scanned raster from stripe pixels or speckles resulting from dirty or wrinkled originals. Raster entity manipulation commands use standard AutoCAD commands on raster regions to easily erase images, lines, arcs and circles. I am using a polyline follower command to select raster line to be converted into a polyline. Next, I'm using recognize text command, which is one of the optical character recognition tools. I select an area on the raster representing text to be recognized and converted into a vector. Resulting single or multi-line text can be further edited and properties such as a font style, size and color be changed. I can use an interactive verification to correct results with dictionary matching. 